Hugh here, welcome to the channel. We'll do our 12 slices now that we got our four rings on as a fuckhead energy comes in and we just boss up. So get over these illusions here. Boom, and Aries. Go after that choice you've been thinking about. Gemini, uh, let go of the reins and see what happens. Gemini, worried about what's been destroyed. Cancer, something is swiftly coming in. Ending the red flags. Leo, mm, something solid and tangible is coming in to harvest. Virgo, you put to an end what's been holding back your fruition. Uh, ten cups there for Libras. They get what they have wanted. Uh, strength implies fear there. Scorpio, a passionate new beginning and something that's mm, golden see the path out. Towers happen underneath the secrets of the moon as our change our perspective and balance comes justice and a weighed heart with it finally opened in victory. Mm -hmm. And cut into nine cups which I believe which was there and the magician. Transformation energy. Hmm. I wasn't quick enough for a minute, sure, so, um, perhaps, yeah, perhaps, um, we'll go back to the mini version of the, um, divine on the bottom there, Hierophant, forcing that will to move, have fear or courage, but the will is happening. <laughs> Mm, okay, Empress comes in here with cups is the transformation to get the wish by leaping into it. The card of creation, the Empress, seems like what's transforming and making a solid foundation. <laughs> to get that victory, back to the end of our book. We have the beginning of the book, now we have the end of the book gets us out of that choppy, vacuuming water <laughs> into a soul contract. Um, yeah, this is it. Um, Aries, share that idea, that choice, and might lead to something bold and beautiful. The Queen of Wands. Taurus, mm, passion, grabbing it by the tangible and letting go of the reins of what you think that is by changing, putting it into will show that passion. All this is governed by truth, balancing ourselves with temperance and leaping into something new. Mm -hmm. Gemini, we had those towers. And that's our, our experience. Don't be worried in your head there as your card falls on yourself. There's choice, love, leadership, taking tell others what you've learned instead of worrying about it. They may give you a different idea. <laughs> Cancer, we had the oh, new idea. <laughs> I forgot the main card. Uh, coming in quickly is that getting back to the flow, that creative energy, what she brings. Um, seeing how it is in the light of the day, I believe is what I said, with the sun shining on the web, shows what's solid and tangible and gets you out of your head. Look up, see it's just all spider webs. Those aren't swords or brambles, they're just spider webs. Put it into it. <laughs> uh, seven of Pentacles, uh, nourishing the fruit and putting it into the one that just makes you always have to defend yourself. Hmm. Uh, let's see, what was under here? Got the Ten of Cups to the world. Libra, you on fire. Look at that. World is your oyster. Make sure you know what you want and just go for it. And if you change your mind, well, you change your mind. But always just decide and go. Hmm. You could even want heartache. <laughs> 
No, that's that's your reward is your dreams in the world. Scorpio, Ace of Passion, Ace of Wands under the bottom with a strength card bookending Leo over here, showing possibly what you've been worried about, so pay attention there. Find a Taurus, or I mean uh, an Aries to share a drink with. Talk about it. Share that idea, maybe. Pull you into the flow instead of mm, the shit you need to let go. Sagittarius, letting go of the reins, like I mentioned for Taurus here, to a passionate new beginning. That Ace of Wands that reflects here as well, too. So boom, 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 boom. Um, yeah, change is happening. Going back to our magician here and um, wherever else he came. <laughs> uh, Capricorn, the miracle happened. It got watered your passion watered and it shows the many paths of of choice to nourish after one knows that the passions are boundless seven of wands there uh forced perspective change or a paradigm shift after the tower falls bookending the tower that's up here to put us in worry again teach Teach and express what you've learned from those experiences, and that may save others from heartache. And they can go on to different lessons without having to learn yours. Show the truth. And the other people are like, oh yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's common phenomena experienced around the world. Victory in opening that heart, weighing it against a feather, the feather is the sword, sword of truth. Shows the resolve that you have, that you're willing to go through heartache again, towers, fighting, even death. That's resolve. That's the light of creation there. From the sun that showed up, and you forge your own path into that victory. Mm, beautiful. Uh, let's do some fast incoming information about our independence and creativity as we put down the burdens and open up intuition, put an end to the illusions and the storms in our head, and the thing that breaks the very fabric around you leap into it like she is and then swat them away you have the weapon you've seen it in the light of day that's the foundation of truth it's all built upon cups yeah. so walk with the truth and get those dreams those wishes to come true I like that. What's underneath that? That Three of Cups again. <laughs> uh, man, that's pretty sugar Cody, but whatever. It's the way. It's the miracle. It's the dream. You just show that it's the better way. I don't know. It's like you have to lead by example. Sometimes harshly. Put an end to... That's this soul contract hoist away, apology will come to the three of cups, walk away, truth, judgment, queen, the cups, the miracle, the dream, the beauty, and dreams manifest. All because you wore the world like a light garment. And wished for, in that end, for, uh, to transform into something to nest, pour energy and love into. Instead of fighting that 
wish fulfilled. Nice. Boom. Page of cups. Cups. What's your deadline for? Your intuition shows you that ain't a secret. The passion, the way out of anxiety is owning oneself instead of juggling the illusions. Look to the moon. Look up. Heartache. It's just what made you an empress. <laughs> and not a, a king of their way. Truth and dreams. Looking up and holding no secrets is the way to transform. Truth is the way to our fantasy, our dreams. What is your dreams? We always say dreams, but do you know what that really means? And of course it's to you. What is? What are your dreams? And do you want them to come true? <laughs> do you want to stand on them? Well, you gotta leap into what makes you feel anew instead of worrying about what burdens you. That's right. Because it's just illusions anyway. So don't be disappointed with that. There's a whole new world to leap into. Boom. Look at that. Changed cups in this new world, or you'll get disappointed every day. And towers and towers and towers and towers. Burdens. So hear the truth in that. Get happy. Get your dreams. At least I'm resolved to. <laughs> so if you find yourself in a dark space, he's got you.